Hi everybody. Today I will show you how to add a score, high score, and how to implement this mystery ship. So whenever you destroy an invader, uh, you score. To add a score, first we need a, uh, to create a variable for all sprites. Uh, meanwhile, let's also create a variable called a high score. Um, so let's use row If row is one or two, we change uh, score we change score by ten and uh, if it is row three or four we change score by 20 and if row is 5 we change score by 30 so let's put this piece of code um, how about here before delete this clone and don't forget you need to um, let's do this uh, at stage you need to set score to zero at the beginning of your game so let's give a test um, let's remove this uh, this remaining invaders we don't need it now and rearrange score and high score ten points twenty points and this one is thirty we can do high score at stage so high score we don't reset it to zero we keep it keep the high score um, for ev whenever you find um, a score is greater than high score that's the time you reset high score you set high score to score now let's implement this mystery ship When the green flag clicked, uh, we will hide. Uh, we will hide the mystery ship and we will put it at the right side of your um, screen. And um, you can make it wait certain time maybe 10 seconds but uh, for testing purpose i will make it a short for now then it will forever come out from right side and move to the left side so every time we will put it on the right side uh, 240 then wait for some random time we can make this like eight eight to 20 seconds but again for testing purpose i will make this short then it will show 
Now it is ready to move from right to left until we'll put in some stopping case. First is uh, when it reach to the left side, left edge. If its x position is less than negative 240, that means it reached to the left edge or uh, touching laser and inside of this repeat loop we will just change its x by a number negative number then it will hide let's give a try Now it's get hit by the laser. This time I'm not going to hit it. I just let it to reach the left edge. So after this repeat until loop, we know if it, it is either reached to the left edge or it is hit by the laser. Only these two cases. So now let's handle the touching laser case. If it is touching laser, uh, we'll give some random points. Let's draw some points. Click on the text. We will just type in 100. Let's give the the font you like and the size you like now it's too small you can see it on the screen very very tiny this is much better and put at the center also find the color you like if you like this red color uh, of mystery ship we can just borrow this exact same color. Yeah. So this costume, we'll call it just 100. Then uh, let's do the same, same thing for 150. make them pretty much the same size you can see the size is like a 70 by 55 so this is good enough and always put them at the center and name this one sorry 150 so we can do bunch of them uh, now i just duplicate them and Type in 200, put at the center, and name this one 200. So I'm going to do a bunch of more. So you see the costume uh, text is matching the costume name. Um, this will help us to add a score later. So now I'm going to um, switch costume. To random from uh, two to eight, because uh, we have two all the way to the eight. These are the points then uh, we can change score by
by costume name. Let's give a try. Oh, see the number come out. We need to uh, switch costume back to original. We don't see the, the the costume because they just hide too soon. So let's um, do some visual effects. I got a hundred points. Four hundred points. Now let's add some music for the mystery ship. So now let's start a new script for the music. Whenever the X position is greater than negative 240, and it is less than 240, we know uh, it is showing. Then we will put on some music. Oh, please select this until done. If it is hit, the music should stop immediately. So here uh, we should add one more condition. That is whenever the mystery ship is in its original costume. It's costume number equal to one or costume name is original. Let's give a test. Huh, this is a bug. Our spaceship should always st start with the original one. So let's fix this. Spaceship, uh, we should always 
switch costume to its original. And it should also show. Make sure it is showing. The music stop immediately whenever it's get hit. That's it for today. I will see you next time. Thank you.